you know, with everything going on, dog, coming out of prison, you know, you bounce back, uh, obviously, you know what I'm saying? You kept working and pushing and you just seem like a nigga that got like a lot of ambition with this shit oh, to, keep, yeah. to keep pushing and keep mashing yeah. no matter what, you know, active moving around, you got that charisma and shit. So Bro. like, uh, you know, with you coming through the game now, dog, you said you recently had some more shit going on, man. Man, on the fucking phone, why this my, <laughs> whoa. What's him? What's him? I'm telling you. Look, I'm I'm doing an interview, bitch. I'm all after we finish, they're gonna pull up the seaside. I'm doing an interview, I'll be like probably like got 30 more minutes, then they're going up. I tell you. One nigga poem. But say it though, recently dog, nah nah. So I so I got out of prison 2014, I took like a five piece, I took five pieces over the head, five years paper, so I took a uh, finish another five. But I ended up walking that shit down early termination due to the fact that I graduated college. That was another incentive too. Okay. I knew, bitch, if I graduated college, the white folk gonna feel sorry. They gonna let my black ass off paper, man. I graduated college, nigga. And it, Louisiana so fucked up. The judge, when I when I, had, I graduated college, nigga, in May, I had to quit in, Ju in June, nigga. The judge ain't let me off probation, bro. Yeah. I'm talking about, nigga, I cried in the courtroom. Even the DA was shaking their head, like, even the secretary, like, when you go to court and they got the little people doing the court minutes and shit, even them women was shaking their head, like, this man ain't let this dude off paper. So I had to come back, like, three months later, bro, they let me off papers. Yeah. Louisiana, fuck, that's why I said, Louisiana don't got, bro, y'all niggas is blessed. Not saying the court system's not here hard, because my daddy worked for TDC, bro. Yeah. He lived with my dad in Nigeria, I'm, I'm Nigerian too, you know what I'm saying? I'm Ibu. Uh -huh. You heard me? My daddy worked for TDC for, like, 25 years. Okay. So we fuck with each other, but obviously we on opposite sides. Judge. But Louisiana fucked up, man. Them people did not want to let me off papers. I had to graduate college and everything. Something that some of their kids ain't even do. Yeah. But uh, the new situation, bro, based on the nigga, my right hand nigga, dog. Nigga who I was introducing to everything. Nigga who I was putting them on. Nigga who I was being a, a big brother to. You know what I'm saying? Like. I don't even really say that nigga name him. I call him direct. Okay. You hear me? Like, you know what I'm saying? But I got the paperwork, nigga, Daquan Bella, ran track at LSU. Like I said, real little brother, bro. Like, I'm like I'm doing everything, you know what I'm saying, that a big brother would, because you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't even fuck with my real brother. They don't take care of the kids, so I don't fuck with you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, right hand man, bro. Man, sold me out, man. Read it on me. This happened in 2019. Yeah. But from and like I say, 2014 I took the paper, so I ain't had got no trouble from 2014 all the way to 2019. This nigga, the fucking rat, decides to wake up one one day and I guess tap his pockets like fuck, bitch, I'm kind of light. I need to do something today. He go catch a place, sell to a nigga who was CI. They pop this nigga. Mind you, I'm again like I say, I'm always on the go. So I might have a spot somewhere, but that don't mean I'm, I live there. So we was living in Baton Rouge last year. You dig what I'm saying? We had a spot together and everything, but many niggas been staying together the last two, three years. Okay. So like you know, I'm I'm putting them I'm putting them in when, when I when I go fuck with niggas, he for he coming. When I'm going to Atlanta, I'm meeting real stand up niggas, he coming. When I'm coming here, you know what I'm saying? Fucking with sauce and them, or fucking with train, he coming. So they identify, you know, he wearing the brain, you know what I'm saying? I got this nigga banging blood, you know what I'm saying? All that, like I'm on some shit with like, you know what I'm saying? You ready to get your flag, nigga, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Make it, make it right, like, you know what I'm saying? I, I'm introducing to my partner, J.O. out here. I'm, I'm introducing it to everything. I'm teaching them the game. Now, he's still in college. Yes. And I say this, I say I look at him as a little brother because I see what he, what he was trying to do. And I'm trying to tell him, bro, what you're trying to do, you need money. You won't be entertaining and be a comedian. You're going to need money, bro. But you don't want to be a regular person. So what you going to do? You want to hustle. I don't, bro, I don't know if you want to hustle. But what come with that is serious. Yeah. It should look good right now, bro. But when it's time for you to take your lick, you're going to have to take it. So you need to make sure. If you're going to sell anything illegal, make that shit worth it for when it's time for you to take your lick. Because you're going to have to take your lick one day about it. Gotcha. That's it. You, you can't run from that. Anyway, man, this nigga wake up one day, go catch a cell, bro. Get pops, son. It don't have nothing to do with me. I'm not even at the house. I was packing up my shit. 
Going to get my little girl, just doing all kind of shit, bro. About to head to Houston, about to head here. And nigga had hidden cameras in our house too, you know what I'm saying? But that's why I said the universe, the universe don't make mistakes. This man get popped, bro. The police held, hold this nigga for like two hours, make him red, make him say all kind of shit. Tell me why, bro, they bring this man back to the house. So say for instance, they catch this nigga at, all right, where we at, where you say we at right now, by the medical center? Yeah. All right, they catch this nigga at Horn Clark going to make him catch a cell. From, they catch him down bad over there and bring him all the way back here. Okay. They can't do that. Yeah. Like, they can't do that. Unless you tell them, I got something over there. Yeah. House in his name and everything. So I'm in that hole. I wake up, nigga. I was looking for a pair of keys for my other whip. And it's just crazy. Like, nigga, that day, like that day, I had like 30 bands on me, but I had to go give some money up and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? So just imagine, nigga, if I'd have been lazy. That's why I, oh, that's why I be like, that's why I'm always strict on handling business. Cause if I'd have been lazy that day, man, people would've hit me for buku change, dog. Like buku change. Probably wouldn't be able to bounce back. Man, they bring this nigga back to the house, bro. He's listening. They bring this man back to the house. The police open the door with the key, dog. They going straight upstairs. Police open up. Now I'm downstairs in the dark. They don't even come. They don't, they don't go to his his room and downstairs. Out of they run straight upstairs. I'm like, them bitches ain't even come. Clear. Cause that's how the police could they come in, they clear. They clear it and the other ones come in, that's how they do. Yeah. So I'm like, man, fuck all that. I don't want to spook them. I said, look, I'm down here. You know what I'm saying? So um, boom. My right hand nigga, bro. From Opelousas. His daddy used to call me son. My little girl used to call this nigga uncle. Uncle Mikey. Uh so my little girl would call me sometime like and be like, can I go, can I go chill with you, Uncle Mike? Man, yes, man, this man did that to me, bro. Now, so they come, police hit the house, they find dope on him. They catch him down bad with dope. They don't find nothing where I'm occupied. They find like a little man, like six bands. But he did it so slimy, bro. Like everything that, like he just did it so slimy, dog. Like it just was so like, he ain't have to do that. No. He could have just, so long story short, bro. And I'm leaving out a lot because I don't know how long. This is it, 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 it's a long Yeah, yeah, we, we we get to the meat potatoes on it, but yeah, we Yeah, yeah bro, we so like long, long. So let me ask you this, like, how do you feel about that now? It's like I just can't even be around you, don't want to even think about you. Like bro, to keep it all the way funky, bro, I really was on demon time for the longest, but it's just like yeah. the way I had I, I had that the way I exposed them, yeah. cause he an internet ass nigga. Gotcha. So I had to expose I had to hurt him like that. Nigga was running track for the white fool. Like, it's just crazy, a lot of intricate shit. Like, one of the narcotics officers knew one of his track coaches. So, you know how that shit went when he stopped him. Yeah. And the laws called it. The narcs came and these other, the narc pilot, hey, I got one of your boys. He yeah. go to LSU. You know what I'm saying? Like, so you know how that shit went. Yeah. Man, bro, come on, the corn. Just, 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 you know, you got a future. Woo, 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 woo. So, how I feel, bro, like, like I said, I really was on some demon time. Yeah. But, we were so close, and we know so many to people, and our city is so small. Like, for instance, my day one homeboy still fuck with him. Gotcha. So, it's like, they got niggas who still fuck with him, who still holler at me, just on business, just on clothes, just on, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, it's so much intricate shit that, like, if it was another nigga that did that pussy ass shit that was from where I'm from, I'd have napped him. Ben, I wouldn't have took it to the internet. I wouldn't expose them for the people can see. But I knew, like, man, I can't even nap this nigga, bro, because it's gonna breathe. It's gonna be too much blowback. Yeah. So I gotta expose this nigga on the internet. I gotta let everybody who who know it, cause he he, he he was a popping nigga he too. Like you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. followers, like had influence. You know what I'm saying? Like, but it's just crazy. Like I put this nigga on everything. Put this nigga on the drip. Put this nigga on the designer shit. Put money in this nigga pocket. Showing this nigga the ropes on all kind of shit. Taught this nigga about credit. Introduce him to my banker so he can get him a credit card. Like this real nigga shit. Not just on some. You know, I'm explaining the, the rules of engagement to this nigga. Like, I'm. Man, get your Twig card, get your Ocean card, nigga, in case you ever get fucked up in this street shit. Where you can bounce back and shake back. Man, I'm just everything. I'm flipping bitches with this nigga, man. Like, making this nigga. 
Throw one of them bitches so you can have an orgy. Just real shit, bro. And this man do that pussy ass shit. Like I said, you can ask him, son. You can ask. It's so like even like him that's right there. Everybody that's in the Airbnb, bro. We all was like this. It, it's so it's so so like that shit really sent me into a deep depression. Gotcha. It sent me into deep depression because I couldn't get my fucking lick back. I still ain't got my lick back. But I'm on some other shit now. I'm on some like music shit. I'm on some music and shit. Business shit. I'm I on see. some music shit. Business shit. Yeah. I know the I know the well being of this man, like this man broke. Yeah. Nigga wanted to kill himself. Like just on some, you know, nigga, like he not even the same nigga who he was that I knew. Like just confidence wise. You feel me? Like cause he, he know the whole shit that he did, dog. Like really just and he really threw a, a monkey wrench and like, you know, between other partners and all that shit. But it, he wait but he did me a favor, he really like exposed. Cause you never know, you never know. Niggas will put a good front on. Like he put a good front on, like that he was like like that, like you know. Some of his family members from the streets and our blues, like our reputations. But I heard a little other shit about some uh, some people that wasn't right, that they wasn't right. You know what I'm saying? But I was like, man, what shit? I feel like this. Nigga do some whole shit. He he got to the push ass way, but I feel like nigga could break a nigga out of that shit and mold a nigga into like. You know, a stand-up nigga in this shit, but you, you can't make no nigga. Uh, if whatever in a nigga in him, bro.